So I have this app, and it is called Quick Scan. You can see by the icon, it is free. And the only limitation is you can only scan three documents at one time. On the bottom, we have the little plus, then I hit camera. Then I want to arrange my view. Notice I already have auto crop selected. Watch so I, we have that little graphic overlay over the image. If you don't like it there, you can always try to turn it off. You can crop it later. So I'm going to hit the camera. Pause still. Notice I now have a one at the bottom for next. So we're going to go next. You can see my files there, but I need to edit it. So I want to rotate it as that view. We can go back. I'm happy with it, so I can go to done. I want to edit some more. So we're going to click on that. Oops, sorry. Okay, so now I click on it again, edit further, and now we can crop it by dragging in the blue balls. So I drag those in. Okay, there we go. I hit save. All right, now we want to save the file. Okay, now we could share it. I want to share as a PDF, and then I'm going to choose send to other app. Here's all my apps. Uh, since I'm doing this in my class, I'm going to pick a Modo. And now, if you don't see that the latest post view, off to the side here, I was already in latest post. That's why I have these three options now. As a teacher, I would pick um, attach to assignment, attach to note. If I attach to the note, I could send it to wherever it needs to go. Uh, in my case, I'm going to just send it to myself. If you don't see your search bar, just type in your name there. Okay, that back. You have to put text in the box. Okay, if you see on the bottom, there's the PDF, and then we send away. Okay, now what's going to happen is if I'm from the student's point of view and I have this file, but I want to be able to edit it, let's say I want to type some text somewhere around here so I can hit the blue square with the arrow pointing up and pick open another app. And for this case, I want to type on it, so I'm going to use Adobe Reader, which is also a free app. Look up top, you see a little speak bubble with a pencil. If you don't see this toolbar, tap somewhere on your document, and it'll come down. And then you have text buttons on the bottom. You could draw on it. I want to use this one on the bottom. Notice that the options tell me what it's doing. Tap where I want to add text. And I could tap right about there. And enter. And save. I can click the object to move it around. If you just drag the box, it's going to resize the box itself. But if you want to make the font bigger, go to font size, and then you can move it around. You can also change the color. When you get it where you want, you hit done. Then you hit the square and the arrow up. And then I'm going to select open and dot dot dot. And again, I'm going to pick Edmodo. Now, from the student point of view, I would pick Attach to Assignment. And I would turn it in with an assignment. And if I was a student, you would see my various assignments that I had the option to do there. So that's it. That's how your students can turn in the work. If you want to see one that I did before, so uh, let's see here. Let's see if I go through my timeline. You can see what it actually looks like. Okay, did this come up? No. Okay. 
So maybe this one. No. Okay, so these were paper documents I sent before. And that is it.